Hi guys, Amanda here, your reigning Miss Woman United States, and I'm very excited to introduce to you our mile number seven partner, who is one of my national sister queens, who also shares my same name, Amanda. So Amanda, why don't you go ahead and tell us a little bit more about yourself, where you're from, and what your platform is. I am the current Ms. United States 2019. My name is Amanda Smith, and I'm the owner and founder of Mini Hooney Chef. Awesome. So tell me a little bit more about Mini Hooney Chef. Yes, and, Mini Hooney Chef. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Thank you for help with the pronunciation there. Tell us a little bit more about your platform, what it is, um, and a little bit more about that name, too. I'm curious. Yeah, so Mini Honey Chef is a local nonprofit here in Hawaii. I'm originally from California, but I moved to Hawaii when I was 18 years old. I created a program 10 years later, and it's really about giving back to kids and families, teaching them how to cook with sustainable foods grown in the Hawaiian islands. Oh, that's exciting. <laughs> oh, man, I like, oh. I want to eat everything. I'm just ready to come to Hawaii tomorrow. And so I want to eat everything your island has to offer there. I know. I, I highly recommend eating the ahi poke, even though LA and San Diego, all those regions have it. But we have the freshest fish on the island. So I highly recommend that and trying something different, something you've never tried before. I will be, I will be trying it. Um, so now tell me to date, what would you say is one of the most memorable or what is one of your favorite things that you've done with your platform? So the most memorable for me is teaching the kids in a larger crowd. <clears throat> so I have this really cool recipe. It's called the Poi Smoothie. Mini Huni Chef Poi Smoothie. And I actually said it when I was on stage during our questions. They were asking me about a recipe. And I shared that one. I, that's the only thing I can really pick up and know really, really fast. But the most memorable is teaching in a crowd of uh, 50 kids and allowing them to see the nutritional pieces that I'm trying to share with them. So the smoothie really consists of a poi, taro. A lot of people have heard of taro. It's almost like a sweet potato. It's a starch. Uh, when you ground it, at, ground it up, it tastes really sour with water. And it's uh, like a gelatinous type of uh, feel. So you throw that in the blender. You get, you know, your, your uh, blueberries, your spinach, all those healthy, you know, all the honey that you can think of, right? So we have local honey everywhere. So you can practically make this recipe as a breakfast. Um, but anyways, I did it with a crowd of 50, and the kids were amazing. They loved it. They tried it. Kids don't even like poi, and now they love it because we're putting honey with it. We're adding in ingredients that they love. And so it, I think it's just more of their smiles. That's the most memorable out, out of all the kids. I'd say two people didn't try it. So, But it, it, it's not everybody's cup of tea, but it's an amazing recipe. <laughs> Fantastic. Well, I think it's such a great thing to be helping teach these kids not only how to cook, but how to use things that are grown locally. And um, I commend you on that. And <laughs> Thank you. I guess lastly, um, is there anything else you'd like to um, let us know about you, about your platform? If people want to donate or get involved, is there a way that they can reach you, etc.? Yeah, so um, we're trying to set up our website currently. It just has a, um, it's a small website, but if you guys want to donate, you can always donate through Facebook, which is fantastic. Um, there's always PayPal and Venmo, but if you go to minihunichef.org, that'll give you a little bit more information about what I do and how I'm serving the community. Um, you can email me for inqu inquiries. It's uh, minihunichefhawaii at gmail.com. Perfect. Perfect. Thanks so much, Amanda, for joining us today. And just want to let everybody know, you can also go to www.fitwithapurpose.org on our 26 to 26. There's more information about Amanda and you can find a link to her website there as well. Thanks so much, guys. Have a good one. Bye.